All right, here we go. Hopefully there will not be the living matter this time because that was bullshit. <laughs> that was fucked up. Um, max amount of sacrifice stacks slower by one. Sure, overheating. Five spark dew is taken from you with every storm. If you can't pay, global production speed will be reduced by 15%. So I want to make some spark dew. Villages have a 10% chance of consuming twice the amount of goods when using services. Scales with hostility. So if hostility is at like 10 or whatever, they're always going to. Villagers with this effect have 5% chance of perishing every 15 seconds. Let's not go above hostility 5. <laughs> you can stop this if they have services then. Okay. Consumerism. Villagers have a 50% chance to consume double the amount of luxury goods. So we double luxury good use. Oh, there's copper in the trees. It's kind of interesting. I started with stone. I started with roots. Let's do this glade. This glade seems like the closest one. High coal incense skewers. Bricks. Bricks pottery. Bricks pottery and dew. Bricks pottery and dew seems good. I don't see any meat. I don't know where I'm going to get meat from for skewers at the moment, or jerky. I'll want to make crystallized you, almost for sure, I feel like. I win the last one. I did, yeah. Plantation, Tinkerer, Forager's Camp. I think we hold off on clicking this one until we see what's going on, maybe? It's humans, lizards, and harpies. No beavers. Food. Do I want to stop them from eating anything? I don't think so. I don't have any of the complex stuff. Brickyard. Archaeologist's office. Costs a billion. Okay, right. well, I'll check that out at some point, but not right now. I don't really know when I'll check that out. It feels like you're constantly struggling to. Get above water here, so to speak. Get it, because against the storm, get it. I thought that was pretty good. Let's, let's build a... Um, I guess I'll also build shelter. Just upgrade the hearth. Get R2 resolve. You weren't paying attention, could I repeat it? I'm sorry, I've already forgotten what I said. It was too powerful to be repeated, let's be real. to do that stuff you you could do that wait what does this do global carrying capacity increased eh, sure sure why not I need to tell them to chop those is the strongest fire keeper. Possibly true, I don't know. Pigment as well. Pigment and copper ore. Hmm. Also, they give extra wood, almost. I mean, they give over... 50% extra wood. Okay, how about they give 60% extra wood? There you go. I <laughs> don't know why I couldn't just fucking say that. 
2 amber for every 20 sea marrow. Three plant fiber for a minute. I think you gotta take that. This takes care of my cloth fur. Okay, let me think about it. That is 30 plant fiber per year. What? What is it called? Fabric? Fabric. So, 30 of this per year? Get like 20 fabric per year out of it? 20 fabric per year. That's probably enough, right? I think you need more than that. Okay, so I'm not super worried about how I'm going to generate the raw resource to turn into fabric in this city. Probably have that under control. Two dangerous glade events. Lizard resolve above 13 for 30 seconds. I feel like... I just unpaused it somehow. I feel like we can do that, yeah? Housing gets us to 6, then 8, then we preferential, and it's at 13. I think we can just do that, like, right now. Plus 1 to fabric production. This would make it even more true that I didn't have to worry about fabric. As parts... Versus Wildfire Essence. Wildfire Essence is also very good. I think I take this for the fabric. Z Slayer, thanks for 22 months! Aw, thank you. Gotta take the Wildfire Essence, I think. So we're going to get to 15 resolve on the lizards, like, right now. Unless, I guess we'll do this, and it will ruin it. We have coal for that. Please don't burn any coal. Harvesting and planting are 80% slower. Minus 8 global resolve. Oh, no, 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 no. a pain in the butt. Source of edible insects. Mm -hmm. Why do I do this to myself? <laughs> like, why? Why, though? If I get hostility back down to one by dropping the choppers, this is probably okay. I'll be at six, then eight. So that'll be at zero. Lizards will also be at eight, I think. Yeah, I have to finish this clearly, but that is what I'm doing. Okay, I think that's fine. I notice there is no fertile soil here. Tools, training gear, and building materials. I want that eventually. I don't think I want a forager's camp. It costs tools, right? I'd much rather have a farm or rely on the like delivery system.
I'll go for a small farm. Assume that we find a place for it soon. I do want a weaver. I maybe want a lumber mill even more, though. I didn't find a thing that makes complex food, which is going to be terrible for my resolve early. Uh-oh. Yeah, well, I don't have a solution to that right now. No lumber mill. We need the planks. Going to this pretty soon, too. I like my people build stuff so slowly. wanted a lizard to be in there. So I'm gonna have to juggle favor for a long time. Let's make that makeshift thing. Nope, the crude workstation is what I actually wanted. Say that word here, Forrester. Game is really sweet, though. I think I can juggle favor for a long time, so I should be fine. Plus insects is going to be really nice. I hope so. Is it five per hour? Is that what it gives me? I don't have it yet, I guess. It is the second season. Let's build this road out. I want to keep chopping toward this. I got a really nice starter one. That's not going to go through, I don't think. I can't quite tell which ones are highlighted and which ones aren't. Wow, having lizards is... Because I didn't have lizards last time, right? Having lizards is so noticeable. The slow... The slow increase is very noticeable. So next I want to get my production buildings up, I think. So lumber mill. Three fabric. Okay. 
Sending the hearth, I have a harpy on the hearth. Oh, I could have a lizard on the hearth. It's fine. Mm, that's concerning. Kind of don't have any fuel. Imagine just dying. Imagine just dying here. The harpy is better than the litter. So I'll just do the micromanaging. It's a long time. Oh, actually only 138. It's not bad. Yeah, I started it early enough to get it before the storm. The start of the game is starting to feel much less complicated to me. Not because it is less complicated, but because I've decided what I want to do at the start. Which admittedly could be wrong. It's just like, since I already picked something, I'm just going to do the thing I picked, you know? Lizards are good on the hearth for um, resolve. But resolve isn't actually an issue right now. So I'll just take the carrying capacity from the harpies, which will speed me up a little bit. Especially when I grab this, yeah? Global carrying capacity. wonder how long it takes to rebuild the angry timer. I can place another woodcutter now, because uh, impatience went up, so hostility went down. Done! Five insects per minute. It feels like having the storage capacity in buildings is hindering me at the start of runs. Forest hates you less if the queen hates you more. Yeah, I mean, Forest and the queen don't get along. I think this is pretty clear. <laughs> there is a very easy way for me to have one more resolve. Oh, I think I forgot, but um, I could have gotten the lizard quest there, maybe. Evil Pina, I am doing well. Mm. 
what is up with you? You're delivering the thing finally. Thank you. game in terms of addictiveness, I could stop it whenever I wanted. Other people may feel differently, I don't know. Let's limit that to 30, but yeah, I'm ready to make some planks now. Lizards are so strong. More lizards. Oh, I don't lose all my food every uh, wet season. That's nice. I like lizards. Kind of like food, too. I need more food than I have, clearly. Debuffs on this rum? Looming Darkness is always there. That's the minus four per hostility stack, plus minus four base. Nursely Element, we can't sacrifice in the Ancient Hearth as much, although I've never sacrificed three ever. If I get to Hostility 2, I need to have five Spark Dew or Global Production Speed goes down. If I get to four, I will be losing some goods. If I get to five, people will perish every 15 seconds. Unless they have services. So we don't want to get to five. Unless we get services before literally everyone. Three barrels for every ten planks produced. I'm gonna just take Rebellious Spirit. This would certainly give me some barrels. Getting a little bit more. Resolve seems important though. Oh, I should open this now. I should have opened it already. If I got under two hostility right now, and then I. 30 seconds, that's it. And then I favored. I could do that quest really, really quick. Fishman Cave. Fishman Cave wants a lot of stuff I don't have. Like a lot of stuff I don't have. I don't even seem particularly close to having it. I don't think there's any way for me to make anything like it. Oil? I think. Is there coal? There's copper. That doesn't make coal. Does this have coal as a byproduct? Nope. Wow, that's tricky. <laughs> I super cannot make that. Uh, there's a bakery here. Biscuits, pies, pottery. That's nice. This is why oil is good. This particular moment. Hmm. Mine brick oven kelm. Oh, 
All right, let's uh, call it Trader. It appears to be time to panic. Why? Why? Why are you at 14 instead of 15? I'm so confused. The quest is for 13. We take that then. <laughs> Fair enough. meat will save me? This doesn't really seem like it. These are all brand new. You're all so expensive. Maybe you're meant to wait until you have the trading post up to do any of this stuff. I will want crystallized dew at some point. Cosmetics, wine. Does anybody care about wine? Wine is luxury, right? Is wine only beers? Mine might only be beavers. Take the coats. I want to make coats anyway. I have fabric surplus, so. I have crystallized you production already. Uh, do I? Don't think so, but maybe. Six people doing nothing? They like to do something, maybe? There's not really much to do. I'm meant to build another woodcutter's cap, maybe? Hmm. You usually won't need to save orders to turn in unless you get a whole bunch of easy early... Easy orders early on. There's going to be a fifth faction. That's cool. Sparky, thanks for the 66 months. Appreciate it. Appreciate you. Oh, packs of provisions. I do not have. I should probably get that stuff going. I from impatience, what could you be doing wrong before you can set up any complex production? Pretty much. Uh, maybe not playing the start aggressively enough? I have one harpy. Hmm. Oh, Twirlof. You have sea marrow? It's probably the cheapest way to solve this available to me. Seamara Risen Oil Coal.
it's still really fucking expensive. <laughs> But yeah, it's cheaper than doing it the other ways, isn't it? to lose three. What is this? Ashes discovered in glades can be salvaged for 10 copper ore and 30. Working effects. Fishman totem spawns every 60 seconds. Pots, planks, and bricks. I'm just gonna send it, I think. I have planks, fine. I guess the bricks are useful. I guess the bricks are useful. I have no idea how I'm gonna make bricks. Oh, probably I'll set up a thing to mine the fucking stone. Okay, never mind. Just send it. Turn off sea marrow. Change goods and disable sea marrow at HS. I think you're a bit behind, are you? It'd have been really bad if it got fed into the fire, though, huh? Yeah, that would not have been ideal. More orders. 16 harpy happiness. That's impossible. <laughs> 40 biscuits? Hmm. I will probably eventually be able to make 40 biscuits at some point. I mean, I could just buy flour, I guess. Wildfire essence. This seems pretty straightforward. I get coal somehow, right? There is no coal here at all. I do not get coal somehow. I could create coal, or like a kiln. I could buy coal, maybe. Packs of goods produced 33% faster. Hmm. I really want the wildfire essence, but I guess I don't need it. This is more approachable, it feels like. I don't know where I'm getting the rest of my food from. It feels like I do not make food yet. Also, there's sea marrow here. I could have just built a thing and harvested sea marrow and not bought it. Oops. Fishman totem here nearby. Are 
other bad events in this game. This one? I don't think there's any rad... Sorry, any bad random events. I think all of the bad events are... Things you have... The ability to see coming, basically. If I didn't complete this fast enough, it would spawn three fishmen totems and give me one impatience point. And the fishmen totems are a little bit iffy. They require me to spend two minutes getting rid of them, or the forest has more hostility, which is bad. Usually. Yeah, it's probably not good. More. Oh, no, I'm already dealing with that one. More clearance? Does this have meat? There's no meat. So we're eating eggs, roots, berries. We probably want to be able to harvest the herbs and grain and turn them into like biscuits, especially with this quest. I don't have much machinery, and I kind of gave the machinery I did have away. Oh, I don't have a builder. Sure. How am I doing on bricks? Still 13? I don't need to set up bricks yet, I don't think. Can get this bakery, which makes biscuits, pie, and pottery. So I definitely want to be able to make the ingredients for biscuits and pie. The new High on Life video game has a character named Jorb. Huh. That's cool. I did not come up with the word Jorb. Maybe the creator was inspired by Boomstar Runner just like me. What am I getting? 20 amber. 20 amber almost finishes that. See you, friend of the trees. Thank you. You have a good one. Totem. So this is where I want to put my next hearth. 
which is probably a priority now-ish. I don't think I can make packs of provisions right now. I don't have enough food. Packs of building materials, crops, and provisions. I mean, we'll wait on that stuff. Do it eventually, but not right now. I did want to look at making a hearth up here. There's some trees to get out of the way. Back there. Did Jorb for job come from Homestar Runner? It did, yeah. Fleet event is completed. Garden of herbs. Am I correct in saying that I need to be able to make flour and that I want to be able to make provisions better? I think I am. Oil and incense. Hmm. Meat, leather, eggs out of grain. I don't have a farm yet. I never make packs of provisions you with you you at you I also have a bunch of amber probably will be useful at some point welcome back to the shop Brickyard for making bricks. At some point, I need to do that. Shit, I'm low on food. I am also not generating food. In order to generate food, make a forager's camp. Like the last thing I can make. Rest in peace, me. I'm sweet, Le Chef. Okay, the storm is here. I do not want to hit this at hostility, hostility 3. Hostility 2... A bit more manageable? That looks like the way we want to take it, yeah? You're favored. Lizards will do fine. Lizards are lizards. Frostpunk, but not much. Shit, everything's horrible. <laughs> I hope the lizards are okay. At least nobody's starving to death. Might as well make some more houses for next wave of people. I could start on specialty housing. Like I could build this right now and it would take care of human happiness. Let's 
you this. I think if I do that, both of these go above zero at the moment. Although, you know, it takes a while to actually do it, I guess. Oh, I cannot make harpies happier than that. So it's bad. Wait, did I get above? No. Okay, we're back to it being good again. Lizards aren't beavers. I don't understand what you're asking. Or saying. I don't know what your what your point is. Clothing stuff yet? Weaving? Artisan? No. I don't have anywhere better for fabric. Okay. I'm at zero food. Everything's kind of stretched, isn't it? Food? Deal. I'm sorry to hear that, Osprey. It's no good. Let's get our global production boost going. Actually, these are movable for free, so I'll just make them right next to everything, and then I can move them later. That makes more sense. Meat specialization. How am I making meat? I could get a ranch. Sure. This is a weird biome. Where's that archaeologist's office? I want to see what it does. It's a bit early to be building it, probably. I want to see what it does, though. Brute cleverness. Maybe I'll give my extra units something to do. Oh, oh shit! Upgrade requirements. One service building. More decorations. One more person. It's not that far away.
Zero food. Food, why? Why food? Tricky biome. Does this have food in it? Oh. Also, I can't build that anyway. I'm gonna have to get rid of my third woodcutter's thing and start making stone, I think. What does this do? Upgrades. Reveals the location of the closest archaeological discoveries. Secret methods of dealing with threats are engraved in ancient tablets. Glade event working time speed is increased by 10% for every two ancient tablets in the settlement's warehouses. What? Speed is increased. So it takes less time to do them, <laughs> I think. Stone tablets reveal the secret of the ancient strength. All workers can carry 10 or more additional items for every two ancient tablets in the settlement's warehouse. So you're telling me that ancient tablets are good now. I don't have any ancient tablets. Is that free? Okay. Oh, I would have found that eventually on my own, huh? All metal is permeated with malevolent magic from the forest. Every two hostility levels grant plus one to simple tools production. Archaeologists have learned how to decipher ancient tablets. You can now use that knowledge to appease the end of your followers. You get minus 15 hostility for every ancient tablet in your settlement's warehouse. Nice boots. Game's sweet, huh? Aren't roots food? They are. And I am harvesting them as quickly as I can. And I cannot harvest any others because I don't have the big harvesting building that uh, is required for it. I wonder if I can make a pack of crops out of something that's not edible. Nope. Wow, I would really be in trouble if I hadn't found the five, um, five lizards per minute, insects per minute, whatever. This one requires actual goods to upgrade. Wait, did it reveal it and then it went away? Oh, when you click on it, it shows it. I wonder if after I've done this thing, it still shows it. We've got roots and a couple of insects. Yep, tighten your belt. It was good enough for our fathers, it will be good enough for us. Something like that. I have so many incredible things. Let's make a warehouse. Bada bada bomb, thanks for the 34 months. Bohika, thanks for the 19 months. Appreciate it. Is it one upgrade per level? Yes. I wonder if you can build multiple of the buildings. Probably not. I'm gonna guess now. Seems like it would be way too strong. so I'm getting rid of it. Let's move this here and dig toward, or that's not digging, chop toward. This archaeological thing I've been told about. Appearances in a minute. I just feel like it's a bit late to be opening that. And yet, here I am, doing it anyway. Fascinating. People just want to watch the world burn. Okay. 
Let's build a park. Let's move over some houses. Actually, I'm going to wait. Second. Give me Albus. Game's good. Game's really good. Trader has arrived. This trader had better have a lot of sweet stuff. I have no money. Herbalists camp. Herbs, berries, mushrooms. Foragers camps, green roots, vegetables. Plantation, berries, and plant fiber. Grain? Roots? I do not have any machine parts to actually build this. It's okay. I can just delete that, I guess. Wait a second, is this also a forager's camp? Oh, I'm silly. Is that fertile ground? It is. I only just noticed that was there. Build a kiln and to make 40 coal. I'd like to keep goods option as a reward for a glade event twice. Seems doable, this seems easier than finding a kiln. Although, did I want to kill him for a different thing already? No. Okay. I'll probably want to keep goods twice anyway. Need for cleanliness filled 60 times. I make better cosmetics and I get more harpies. Oh, 10% movement speed and arts heal. And I'm somewhat good at making building materials. Not incredible at it, but like, I'm pretty good at making wood, and I'm very good at making planks. I'm <laughs> liking what you play as an FPS and MOBA thing. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. When I don't like a game, I just stop playing it. That's always been my approach. I don't really need to build another foragers camp so I guess I did anyway I don't know I found an apothecary apothecaries make cosmetics incense and biscuits those are three new things that I didn't have yet that's really cool and all this is is a living matter and I don't have food anyway and it gives me a ch oh my god Are you kidding me that's such a good clearing and I have a bunch of fertile ground? And a bunch of grain. This is extremely good. All right, sweet. Uh, let's do that. Uh. Um. <laughs> no, you could do that. High level of corruption? Are you kidding me? Why you gotta be like that? I 
I always forget that that's a thing. Well, it's only been a thing twice, and I've forgotten both times. But like, always is maybe too hard on myself. Builders, do I actually have two? It should be enough. Priority one would already be enough to send everything to it, but I like to like panic an appropriate amount. I've already basically accepted that I'm having three people die from this. <laughs> um, but you know. Why do the ruined buildings always... Maybe they don't always. They seem to very often have the doors looking straight onto the fertile ground, which irritates me. Only 34 seconds to build this. So harpies are good at this. Lizards like doing it. The harpy. I do you want to get some of these quests done? What did I choose to do here? I didn't get a choice. I could rebuild that. Did I learn the method of finding camps when I lose them? No. Is there one? What's the method of finding camps when I lose them? Uh... My cat is snoring. Oh my god, cat, you're so cute. I have so much spark here and so little to do with it. I have arguably overproduced that. Hover over the camp in the build menu and hit light left or right arrow. I don't have a uh, arrow keys on my keyboard. Hold on, can I do that? I don't have keys. Um. Oh, cool. That's a neat trick. I would never have worked that out on my own in a million years. Maybe it's written somewhere. Maybe there's like a tips screen or something like that. So if I upgraded this right now, minus 15 hostility for every ancient tablet. Minus 15 hostility could be good. Nordexa, I'm doing pretty well. Definitely doing okay. Why are my people so unhappy all the time? Why won't you just be happy? <laughs> Why does this have to be such a struggle? I feel like I've gotten so much better at understanding how to make them happy too, and they're just like not, <laughs> just not happy. <laughs>
Did I manage to... I have two fuel reserves. It's probably enough. Hopefully that's enough. Oh yeah, and they're right next to the thing too. And I only have to kill one of them. All right, I did it fast enough. Holy shit. What happened? Minus nine? Hunger, hunger three. Average bonus minus seven. Okay, goodbye, Harpies. It was nice. Um, it's too bad. Oh my god, what if the ones that are killing the blight leave? That'd be kind of incredible. Have I considered making more food? I keep on running into these living matters which are not very kind to your desires to have food. They're like, so you would like to have food? And then they're like, no. <laughs> you cannot have food. Sorry. But the one that was hungriest leave? Oh, the one that was hungriest left. That's a neat trick. Blight is under control. Super under control, actually. That's Spaceman Spiff! I just... That doesn't go back above zero, apparently. Oh, God. So we lose lizards as well. Are lizards hungry? Lizards are also hungry. Lizards have minus five from unfair treatment. Hostility of forest, looming darkness. I guess they just don't have much happiness. I guess that's the basic problem. The builder lizard has left. Maybe I lose one more still? Wouldn't be too bad. more. Lizard scout left. That would be the one finishing that task. It's okay. So we lost two pop. But we get another four. Clay is useful for making bricks, which I kind of need to be able to do and kind of cannot currently do. You must first give, lose all stored fuel upon picking this cornerstone. Hostility reduced by 15 points every time you sell goods worth 25 amber. Isn't that kind of broken? I would need to be able to make packs of provisions, which I cannot make. I'm taking this. Action JB, you think so? 43 months? How's the new game? It's excellent. You recommend? Get pies going. I think I might be able to get pies going now. Also, maybe I could build a lizard house. Since we are struggling with lizard happiness, it feels like a lizard house might be a good idea. I'd really like another blueprint, but we are a long way away from another blueprint.
Did this start as a sponsored game? Nope. I think I meant to be... I think this 10% global production speed is maybe less important than getting plus two global resolve in another place. There's a current observation that I have. This makes bricks. I don't know what the third level of hub gives. I will find out soon. I'm excited. I don't want spoilers. Looking forward to finding out. So many packs of crops and trade goods and shit. Next trader? Five minutes. So that is just barely before the next storm. An archaeological discovery. Sparked you and something else result in me having an excavation. The ancient skeleton has to be unearthed and an ancient tablet. Okay. Let's get this, um... Why is that highlighted? Oh, they're all highlighted. I need amber. I'm not going to be able to sell anything, huh? Like, absolutely not. Other woodcutters can. I finished this forager's camp. I'm not sure that's what I wanted. Finished this. I need to make flour. Can I make flour? I can make flour to provisioner if I build a provisioner. Let's build a provisioner. This takes priority over whatever else I was building. I don't even remember. I'm trying to do that. That's fine. I still need a farm. I have all this fertile land. I actually have a ton of fertile land here. Is this my first Scarlet Orchard? It is, yeah. Marge's camp is empty. Resource nodes depleted during the drizzle spawn fertile soil. Oh. What? I never read that. So that's why I have fertile soil there. There wasn't fertile soil at the start. It appeared underneath that. Understood. That also means I need to, like, be... Mindful of when I deplete these, I guess. If I want to get more fertile soil, maybe I do. I don't really know if it matters. I have a lot of fertile soil. Let's put this near a warehouse. Should have somebody making fabric. I do have someone making bricks. I'll be out of the basic resources for bricks pretty soon. A 
I'm spending a lot of time on this and it's not actually doing very much. I guess when the next trader comes, if I sell up to 10 amber, I can get my next blueprint and maybe that'll do something with fertile soil. Yeah, I guess that's the plan. These are not going to deplete anytime soon, right? Maybe like three years, two years. We consider destroying the ozone so there can be a no more storms. Is that what happens if there's no ozone? I'm not sure that's what happens if there's no more ozone. deliver that. I get 10% ooze speed and parts and 30 copper bars. Okay. That's well worth it. What do I do with my copper bars? I sell them immediately. In 1 minute 57 maybe. What do I do with my parts? I already have two of those. Start mining stone finally? Okay, finally start mining stone. I wanted I could do this. It's a lot further from warehouse though. Priority. What prestige have I made it up to? I don't even know what this is. Does it say here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Looks like seven. Hey, Zyke. I hope you're doing well today. 10% move speed's nice. There's no flashing bits to make you pay only $99 and $99 to get your builds complete instantly and a bucket of gems used to buy more in-game items. It's a bit strange, isn't it? And yet it's still fun. Perhaps that's the most perplexing part. Did I stop these from going? I need those to stop going. Concerned about this storm that's coming. Oh, why is my resolve always so bad? It hasn't improved since the start of the game. To make flour. It's because I haven't been making jerky recently. Jerky is such a good intermediate step. New order. Clan hall. 20 aesthetic stack orations. Okay. Uh, I feel like I could do that right now. Like I have good plank production and nothing else. Put these all at minus one priority. Red bar's not a problem yet. Red bar actually reduces the hostility of the forest, so it's like kinda good at the moment, actually. I'm gonna sell all these. And probably something else, but I'm not sure what. Pigment comes out of the trees. 
Don't really need to stockpile that. One of these good copper bars. Crystallized dew production is better. A tool shop. A tool shop would be okay. That completes amber trade. Tricky thing is I'll give away 10 amber when I turn that in. Let's get the blueprint though. Let's see what we're working with. Herbs. Sure. And I can make flour. Skewers and jerky. They're both kind of good. Um, I think I go for this. What happens when you attack a trader? I don't know yet. I haven't done it yet. Perhaps someday I will find out, but it is not a thing I've found out so far. I already had small farms. Oh my god. Small farms this entire time. Oh no. Well, I put a herb garden there. I gather this wheat. I put them together with flour, which I make here. And in the end, we end up with complex food. That should be good. I'm still, like, somewhat happy to have taken the herb garden, I think. Maybe also take a grain farm. I want to stop using planks. I don't know why you're here. You literally are not allowed to build anything. Um, we're making planks as fast as we possibly can. Getting all this ready for next year. Looks like there's more fertile ground underneath that. Um, and then the other thing I wanted to do now that I have amber, I need two more amber. is I want to upgrade this, like so, but I only need 15 planks. My planks seem to be getting used all the time. So how do I do that exactly? How do I prioritize that upgrade? Seems kind of impossible. Oh, the storm is coming. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Why me? What have I done to deserve this fate? And I don't think so, 26 months. Let's 
He's gonna raise things for the 61 months. It is winter, isn't it? The storm. How much wood do I have? I could burn wood through this. Actually, I'm fine. Lizards are up here. Building specifically for lizards is a sign you have in your front door. Respectable. percent chance of doubling production move 20% faster. Maybe I shouldn't be destroying these ones. Probably I shouldn't be destroying these ones. But it's only active during... I think it's active all the time actually. Definitely might be sensible not to destroy that blight rot. I need one farmer there. Two farmers here though. All these farms I have all of a sudden. I need building all my stuff. I don't know what that is, it's a provisioner. Provisioners make flour out of grain. Just need grain. I love lizards. Parts and tools. Gotta take it. This needs four more population, and I do have that many more people. A singular tool, sure. Technically, yes. Urban root production is increased by one for every 75 biscuits produced. Fire Keeper's armor. Trade roots are faster by 40%. Let's do this. It's so slow. It is so slow. It's really slow. Maybe it's too slow to be worth taking. Should I open this? I should open this. Should put my choppy boys back to work. is what makes biscuits. No. 
Am I producing biscuits yet soon? Am I winning? I feel like this one's winnable. I feel like this one's pretty comfortably winnable. I still need planks to upgrade this for minus 30 hostility. Which I think will be good. Right now I am completing a quest with my planks instead, which is weird. Strange prioritization of things. That is what I'm doing. I'm still low on food. In fact, I just pulled a lot of my food production away. <laughs> so I'm like lower on food than I was before. It is a strange choice. Uh -huh. I reach the point where the game becomes really hard. It's definitely been trickier. I was not that far away from losing the last one. Can you like just take the the planks and do that thing? The priority system it would be really nice if you could put scouting in the priority system, right? Kind of irritating that you can't. I like that it feels a bit closer yet winnable the last two runs. Yeah. Definitely starting to get more pressured at the start. Harmony Spirit Altar. When your village's needs are met, harmony is fostered. Each unique service building adds two to global resolve. It counts as nine decorations of its type. Ooh. Harmony has been disturbed. All species become less resilient. Resolve drops much faster. Okay, but I just walk in and do this, and then it's done, yeah? That's it. That seems like a really good glade. There's also more fertile ground. Scouts are idle in archaeological excavation. There's another tablet I can take. But it's difficult. Look at all these herbs I have. Where'd they come from? Um, Because I have herbs, and I think I now have grain as well, Come on, I must have grain. I'm about to have grain. I should do that. And I should put a lizard here and make biscuits and pies. Maybe biscuits first. And then pies. I'm gonna need two lizards there. Vegetables, I don't want vegetables. Whoops. Two events looted. Do you think this counts as looting it? Convert. I don't know if that counts as looting it. I think something that I'm going to get much better at very quickly is keeping track of these building supplies going through the middle of the game and not like overbuilding when I don't have enough, like understanding how much my plank generation actually is right now. I'm building the appropriate things when I can build them. It would be good to build another hub down here if I ever get the resources. I need another one of that they're not here 
It would be good to start on packs of provisions to get trading going. I can do that now. It's just kind of iffy to do it with herbs. Really? I did it with insects and didn't let people eat insects. What would people eat instead? All those are roots. Nothing. People would starve. That's the only thing people are eating. <laughs> They're kind of eating roots. Your current vampire survivors run is making your eyes hurt, so you're watching jorbs. Fair enough. Is there any way to rotate the viewpoint? I just became dizzy. I regret my decision. Oof. The answer is yes, then, obviously. How many builders? I have one builder. Is that my builder? Nope. Where's my builder? I have two builders. Chop, chop. A challenge run of this where your viewpoint is always rotating. That sounds awful. That sounds terrible. No, thank you. So this is a service building. So is this, so is this. Wealth effect gives global resolve. This is how I've won in the past, like just one outright. I won the last round off that effect. These are expensive buildings. I think we take that though. I'm not building the stuff for it, so I won't like work, but it'll give two global resolve from this just to create it. Each unique service building adds two global resolve. It'll also let me upgrade this to whatever the next level is. It needs a service building. This is my chance. Oh, I finally have enough for this thing. What are these? Any villager loss will be prevented at the expense of an ancient tablet. That sounds actively bad. I'd rather lose a villager. <laughs> All workers get 10% higher chance of doubling their production for every two completed Dangerous Glade events. And this is added attractively. Cool. I don't have any of these things. Someday I might. Maybe also do this one? For this one, that one's forbidden. That one's super scary. So is that one. Everything's scary. Ah. Terrified. Terrified, petrified. It's expensive, but it's buildable. It won't take that long. Takes a minute for that to show up. Forbidden Glades have such a good loot. Yes. Yeah, maybe I'll do it like. Let's get stuff under control at home. Like, get the food production going, and then I can do stuff like Forbidden Glades. I'm very close to. Look, I'm just finishing my first batch of biscuits right now, in fact. Unfortunately, my green seems to be very slow. Also, apparently I'm making packs of provisions. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. That means I can send this, finally. Who wants stuff I have? Literally nobody. <laughs> I guess I don't have much. Wait, don't I have this? Not enough provisions. Oh, I didn't put them in the warehouse yet. Yeah, that would be an issue. Jarring that the music stops when the game is paused. Mm. Cutting into small glades worth it for this difficulty? I don't know. I'm not sure. I haven't been doing it recently. And I haven't felt like it's wrong not to. But I'm not sure. 
So this uses 8 flower every minute 17. This makes 10 flower every 38 seconds, if I had that. Um, so this should be able to support two people here, in theory. I just don't have enough green for it. But I think we're like in the process of fixing that. Resolve has gotten worse. They're hungry. They're hungry. Also, I harvested this and it wasn't during the rainy season, so I didn't get fertile ground, and that irritates me. That's irritating. It's silly. <laughs> I don't like that. What a silly thing to expect people to try to pay attention to. Is this? Oh. Almost. Who needs a fancy house? Humans, maybe? Oh, no, okay, Nick. What if I started listening to music that wasn't the game audio? Are y'all ready to not have the sound effects yet? That way it wouldn't pause all the time whenever I paused the game. Which admittedly I do quite often. Interesting that you can open this and the game is paused but the music keeps going. Um... One of those. Thought it should just not pause, it's inconsiderate. Yeah. I generally think I agree. Music's the best part about the game? Okay. So I just have to stop pausing. My bad. It is early access. There's already a list of changes that they're planning to do though, so I want to read what that is before I recommend things that might already be on it, you know? I'm so close. Uh, I actually have it. Probably another two global resolve. Is this working? It's working. I love that this order comes in at the start of the storm. I think that's really cool. I have these, but I don't want to give them away. I guess I could wait until the very end to turn this one in. At least 18 villagers with need for brawling at the same time. Let's do this one. Um, also, the whole not dying thing. Right. And I should put my woodcutters near warehouses again. Somehow. Maybe there. How much stone do I have? 40? Production on that seems important. Production on this seems important. You have a whole 19 fuel. You're sure that's fine. Interesting. Um, whoops. You don't have any wood. <laughs> That's a disaster. We 
Maybe let's limit this to six. Maybe that's the plan. Or maybe ten. I don't know. I didn't even look. Okay, we're good. The lizards will be fine. Suddenly I have packs of provisions. What is this? Got it covered. All good. Hey, look at that. So I could grab the wealth effect, but I think currently it's giving like zero resolve. But just in general, that should give two resolve, yeah? Or something. Converted Harmony's Spirit Altar. Yeah. You admire our faith in the lizards haven't betrayed me yet. I just did an entire harvest season and I did not get enough grain and I ran an entire farm on grain and I was harvesting grain the entire time. Um, are we building another farm for grain? Maybe start by chopping more of this out. If I put this here and then delete it, does the fertile ground come back? I don't know. Let's open this actually. While I'm here, why not? If you have resources in an internal storage of a fraction building and you want them back for something else, you can X them out there and they teleport back to storage. Yep. If you delete the building, the fertile ground disappears, but if you move it, it should be safe. Oh, that's weird. That's super weird. That one's goofy. Why am I lizard suddenly happy? Weird. Choose one blueprint from all unlocked blueprints. I guess I just take another production building with that. Also, I have a trader here. Three planks production? Three. And you have these. You're fancy. I wish I'd done a better job of generating amber. Uh, what else? Bricks, fine. Fabric, kind of fine. That might be all I want. I don't need this ever, I don't think. That's all the copper used for? Selling, apparently. What's the best one? 
What do I have already? I have brawling and education. Cleanliness and something else? Cleanliness and luxury? Does anyone use luxury? Nobody does luxury. Guilds, welfare. Wait, I thought this one I already had. What is this? Oh, that's different. Okay. Let's do the guild house. Seems really powerful if you know all the buildings. Agree. I need woodcutters, please. Good trading. I think I have sea marrow there. How much stone do I have? Yeah. I got portal. <laughs> portal. I got portal ground again. Did the fire thing upgrade? Does it have a sweet new bonus? <gasps> District. 10% to global extra production chance. So it goes global resolve, then speed, then extra production chance. Does that mean. What does extra production mean? Does that mean it doubles production or? I don't know what that means. I'm not sure what extra production is, if it's double production or if it's the byproducts that you get sometimes. This feels sort of like I should be running this like all the time-ish. 10% chance of double resources. Okay, cool. Seems good to have. The only one I can do. Thanks for three wood. Seems like a good deal. <laughs> if you stack enough double resource chance, do you start getting triple resources? Mm -hmm. Humans are pretty happy, they're okay. Harpies are actually the ones I want to get reputation from, though, because humans have a threshold of 30, whereas harpies have a threshold at 15. Traders will arrive 50% quicker. And wealth effect. Wealth effect, kind of huge. Although I don't have many money. This is an archaeological discovery. 60 hostility every 60 seconds. It's kind of free. Keep goods. Five ancient tablets? What? It's over. GG. Well played, everyone. Do this too? Not yet. The fire is going out. Okay, when I said GG, it's over. That's not what I was looking for. <laughs> I have wood still. It's fine. I am low on fuel, that's true. 
What are ancient tablets used for? Right now I'm using them for this. I get minus 15 hostility for every ancient tablet in my settlement's warehouse. That's minus 75 hostility. I guess it's not actually that strong. It's kind of strong enough. Put this near a warehouse again. Looks like I've chopped most of the stuff that's near a warehouse. At some point I'm going to want to get off that stone and go mine the fuel instead. There's more stone up here. Let's build the farm I was talking about. Do I want grain or herbs? Uh, is this grain or herbs? I want both. Grain. Uh, it's a long way from warehouse, but do I have another one of these to place? I do. Which means maybe it would make sense to put a warehouse here. You move on, Frito. We're unhappy for some reason. At least we stopped being as happy. Is this messing with me? Oh, it's giving extra hostility. I do have enough time, right? Yeah, I have enough time. It is giving a lot of hostility. I needed bricks again. Working on the fabric. Is there a hotkey for these? No, maybe, I don't know. Five of that, 31 of that. Yeah, I want two people here now. I didn't plant all of these? Oh. Rip. Uh, prestige seven or eight or something? Hotkeys are in the roadmap. That's good. Yeah, this game could definitely benefit from some. Just planks. Must be pretty close to having those two. Um, it's unfortunate that everyone's just like starving to death. <laughs> it's it's definitely not helping. I'm kind of surprised that it's happening. Because I feel like I'm doing a good job making food. But I guess um, we've gotten to the point of the game where it's harder to make food. 
It's fine. I think I actually do want to make pie sometimes. Doesn't this also make biscuits? It does, and it makes them okay. I'm just gonna run out of flour now. And 40. So options, stone there, stone there, fuel here. I think we take the fuel. One of the ways it feels like I could lose this is if I make a mistake and don't have fuel. I'm at a hundred now. I managed to stockpile some wood. Not going quite as hard on planks anymore. Can you unpack packs of unpack packs of provisions and eat them? No. Why do I have twenty nine of those? Oh, for this. Um, I don't need to make more than like fifteen of those ever. Packs of crops and packs of building materials. Four, three. Okay. Don't have a builder anymore. This looks really scary. It looks like I'm about to die, but I'm not, because uh, this is about to finish. And when it finishes, hostility is going to go down by 300. And then I'm going to get three global resolve instantly from this, and I'm going to get minus another 75 hostility. When I return the ancient tablets. So, should be good through this storm. And there's trade goods, building materials, and crops here as well. Just noticing now. Human houses. I should build a human house. This is the neighborhood that needs more people. Oh, it needs lots more people. This is like the start of the game is about learning to manage um, resolve. And then you get into the part of the game that's much more about learning to manage production. I didn't harvest like half of that. Out. Okay, storm time. Are we good? Four would be consuming twice the amount of goods. I would rather not. I seem to have already figured why the planting and harvesting is too slow. We're vibing here, Violetta. Um, vaguely, like I mostly understand what's going on with everything. Oh shit, I just picked up everything, just like that. That was so fast. Um, I haven't done tool production yet this game, and I might not need to. We'll see how hard the resolve kicks in. I think it's going to kick in pretty hard. Yes. Sure. 
Doesn't work. Sure. Hey, guild house. Gained one. It's not a ton. Probably not even worth equipping right now, honestly. There's a warehouse here, which makes it easier to chop through this. Admiral's thanks for the eight months. Appreciate it. Hope you're doing well. I need so many human houses. That was the storm? That was the storm? My lizards are about to have 24 resolve. Hello? Got six more pop here. Plus two stone production. Yields for packs of goods. That seems good. I'm making lots of packs of goods, it looks like. Um. Oh, damn. Some builders. As the blue bar goes up, it brings the red bar down, so it might look a bit scary, but I'm actually in a pretty strong position. A winning position, maybe even. finally got oh shit it's plus one grain production wait that's i should have done that a lot earlier okay i gotta remember what my rewards are this one will be good to do next maybe i need to keep goods at a glade I need to open this let's go Am I also opening that? I don't think I want to open two at once. It might be a bit much. But it does seem like time to win. Hostility just went up one. Hostility just went up more. Why is hostility happening? Why are they angry at me? Oh, because impatience is going down. Tavern? That's another service building, so it will give me another two uh, global resolve to complete building it. I need more builders than I have. I need more people than I have. What's in this? I'll just go build. Smelter. Da, 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 da. Packs of goods faster. Eh. Villagers move 10% faster on roads. That seems good. And then let's sell kind of everything ish. Sell a bunch of those. I don't have much. So I guess when I said sell everything-ish, I meant um, sell the, like, two things that I have. Okay. I'm gonna just click the red button. 
Mm -hmm. I don't think that's how I'm winning right now. I don't know what that does, but I imagine it doesn't result in you having lucrative trade deals going forward in the rest of the run. sell apart. Was I selling five amber for four amber? I have a thing. Every time I sell goods worth 60 amber, I get one global resolve. Not a ton of global resolve, but it's a little bit. It is worth caring about. It's too true. It feels like actually building the things that are used in the service buildings is just not necessary. Like, just why? Could reroll this for another service building? The service buildings themselves give you, like, so much resolve. So you don't need to. Oh, that's huge. Fishman Lighthouse. Can't do this. Threats. 50% slower glade work. One impatience. If I keep this, I get a thing that gives me sea marrow constantly. If I salvage it, I get insects for mushrooms, better roots and clay, and a bunch of meat. I mean, it's kind of cool to keep it. This looks pretty sweet. Increase hostility of forest by 300 for every hearth in the settlement. I'm going to have to do this after the storm, which means that I'm going to get hit by this once. I'll say do it now and go into the storm at hostility 7 billion. Yeah, I'm going to get hit by that once. I guess I opened that at the wrong time. <laughs> so, good night, Ignis. Glad you enjoyed it. It's like kind of fine. Ooh, there's another one of these. I do have to, um. I have to get enough sea marrow for it to actually work. How much more of this do I have? Tons. Let's make sure we're not burning sea marrow. Lighthouse Hostility Debuff is no joke. Yeah, it's gonna be nine levels of hostility. So, you know, we probably don't want to go through a storm with that. Just, just going out on a limb. There's someone in here. This is pretty buildable. If that hearth didn't just finish, I could have paused the third one. Yeah, it still would have been awful to try to run it. Like, it's not going to be an issue um, after the storm and would be horrible inside the storm either way, so not too worried about it. Packs of trade goods? Do I need those? I think I do. Is that new? Mm, it's worse than the lumber mill at it. Wait. Wait, it says it's better than the lumber mill at it, but 6 for 2 is worse than 8 for 3. So what? What is going on exactly? 
that's confusing. Nice fluffy cow. This game looks amazing and my already in hard difficulty. I am less than halfway through the ascension system. And it continues to like, the ascension levels have been pretty consequential recently. Keeps on getting harder and harder. Do I have a plus one to Pax perk? Oh, yeah, I think so. Yeah, it's probably some sort of perk, you're right. Looks like I'm actually starting to have a flower surplus. Which is good. I feel like I shouldn't have sold my bricks. I love how you learn a, a strategy to get through the game and the next level of prestige nerfs it. It's, yeah, I haven't had trading get nerfed for me yet. Trading has been really strong. It's another big farm if I want it. I do. Did I get the human houses built yet? Still no. Bricks are my choke point, huh? I'm out of clan stone. Uh, uh oh. Also, I should probably run this with two. I'm out of clay and stone. I feel like this environment is the most difficult of the ones that I've done so far. Feels like in this one, I'm not getting the things I need incidentally nearly as often. This would be a faster way to mine this. Also, this does make um, stone sometimes. Doesn't happen that often. What if I called a trader right now? How much amber do I have? 35 already? Let's do it. There are some big perks to the environment, I just haven't gotten them yet. Yeah, I'm also unlocking like strength for me, like new buildings and new passive perks and stuff. So at the same time that the game is getting harder, it's like also getting easier, weirdly. I think I want this one. And then I'm like happy to... Okay, hold up. I don't think there's anything there that helps with the fish thing. Another resolve for me. Are the movement speed perks ever worth it? Yes, I think movement speed's very good. That one is only for woodcutters, but like it's still very good, I think. When this finishes, it's another two. Harpies don't have houses. I guess once this finishes, we're good. Oh, shit. Do you have stone? 
play. There you go. Why was he getting the stuff that this was making? <laughs> Is a flubber. Doesn't have to be literal amber from trades, but you can trade for items and sell them back at inefficient rates to try and raise resolve. Yeah, I've only been doing the amber because, like, it seems like I have to think less or something if I do it that way. I could be doing all the items as well, but it doesn't seem necessary, so I haven't been bothering. I want to be below four. These are all going to stay easily positive. You have the sea spray for the tower thing now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I can't start it until after the storm. That would not be a good choice. I think I can speed up now pretty comfortably. Do not think I am in danger anymore. Skewers? Make some skewers, maybe? I don't really have meat, do I? <laughs> nice for some. I have a surplus of everything, basically. Flux, thanks for the five gifted subs. Interesting how quickly it all sort of breaks in your favor altogether. I don't think it was worth it to open this glade. Because it's just like, because of the 11 hostility, I'm not getting resolve at the moment, and I'm not going to for four minutes. And this is going to happen... Uh, doesn't matter that much. A stack of the wealth effect for every two caches opened. I've opened zero, I think. Just do this. I need packs of crops, 10. I need packs of building materials, 10. I need, I can turn this in. Is that resolve or five more humans? Five more humans. Um, packs of trade goods. Oh, yeah, but I had nothing to build these out of. Oh, no, flower. Very strange to me that flower works for this. But I won't complain. I meant to loot two events. I don't think I'm going to do that. I don't think any of these do anything. How fair we in this contest with the storm? Seems to be going all right. Bring some bones to speed up events. Can I? I mean, I can, but yeah, I'm just gonna run out of them. Oh, I have so many. I didn't realize how many I have. High level of corruption, maybe two on the blight post. Maybe stop limiting that. I think I'll be fine either way. 
This is done. Five sea marrow per minute. It's, it's cool. Now the problem is I meant to like win as quickly as possible, right? Ah, uh, not really doing that. But the way the game is set up, it rewards you for winning as quickly as possible from here. Green? I have no money. Builder can carry 15 additional items. Um, no one can resist the lure of the mystery box. It's extremely true. So true. Yeah, they do also seem like good value. I mean, I'm not going to say no to a bargain, you know? storm here? Uh, um. Oh, I forgot about this building entirely. Meh. Also, there's this thing. Seems kind of free. Difficult and difficult and difficult and difficult and then easy. <laughs> Big totem can be relocated besides a hearth to provide a decoration muscle. Wait a second, this one's probably closest, yeah. It's pretty close. Two greens. Scouts are idle. Sure. Looks like a game you could spend a dangerous amount of time on. It's a fun game. It seems kind of good. All right, I think we just win now. Just will tap with resolve. Right? Actually, will I? It's not happening. <laughs> Maybe I actually need to get prestige other ways. Anything here? What if I sold everything and then I just died? 
because I like needed something. That'd be great. That'd be very funny. I'll try not to do that. <sighs> okay, where are the things to open? This one. This one. This one here. Year nine is a slow win. Hey, it's a win. Tiny scroll arrows below the name of the cache. Yeah, I know. I don't know. For some reason, I don't click on them. Guess I could turn in the building materials. Ancient tablets are worth a lot in trade. Oh, but I like them. <laughs> I like them and they're mine. I found out what ancient tablets were. It was Prestige 7, apparently. Am I winning? Am I doing better than my competitors? I hope one of them is like Gaston or something. That would be really funny. Grizzly Banana! Thanks for the Prime! How long does the run usually take? They're taking me between two and three hours, it feels like. I'm not necessarily playing them as quickly as I could, though. I'm still learning the game. Big Shelter. Can accommodate any villager, but won't satisfy the need for species-specific housing. Has to be built near a hearth. Number of places, six. Weird. That's like a really big deal to unlock that. I wonder what it costs. It's an essential building. Number of places, six. Hmm. Very cool. There's still a lot of stuff to do. Looks like I have achieved about 25 to 30%. Maybe more given that those I just achieved as well. What's my win percentage though? So far? So far I haven't lost one yet. But there's always time to lose. I'm sure I'll start dying soon enough. I think if I got bad modifiers on that one, I would have lost. Or at least would have come close to losing. If you embark with a herbalist's camp, does that mean you get more parts effectively? You don't have to build one. Embark with all this shit. Discount from traders. Trade routes active. More trade routes active. Can I get that? No, I don't have enough of these things. Artifacts. I'm running really low on artifacts, actually. What is that? Newcomers bring more resources. It's quite good. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe I should just get that. Go straight toward 10% more Citadel resources. Unlocks a pool of difficult, time-sensitive, and highly rewarding orders. One additional caravan. 30 seconds of time after reaching max impatience. Try to save your settlement.
another 30 seconds. Wait, that's like extremely game changing. So you can like deliberately stay at um, max impatience and then turn in a quest with one second left. That's huge. It's a really, really big deal. You want the embarkation range first. Do I? Why? Because it lets me go to places. The thing is, right now I can already go to a place that isn't next to anything else. That's the best I can do, right? Can't do better than that. Would it let me go here to get that question mark? Maybe it would let me get the question mark. All right. Where's the embarkation range? All towns unveil more of the world map. You can see more of the world map. I don't know where embarkation range is. Ah, this one. You can venture one field further. Okay. That's a long way away. I need 24 artifacts to do that. I do not have 24 artifacts. I'll try. You go farther, you can get out more sticks. Wait, this does let you go further. And this rewards 34 of the artifact things. But there's something evil here. The crown warned you not to settle near giant sparked you crystals. Start with six impatience. Oh shit. Okay. Okay, maybe I'll lose this one. <laughs> that seems immensely losable, right? Although hostility will be very low. Huh. Huh. I mean, we go for it. What is this? Royal permit. Additional cornerstone reroll charge. Are these only? We have more parts. I feel like Lizard Hyaman has to be way stronger, even minus five parts. We get pies. I love pies. Oh, and we get two extra units. Yeah, I don't think that five parts is worth that much. Like, it's good, but it's not worth that much. Lizards are way stronger early, and... I get an extra two pop. I'm gonna run to the bathroom. We'll be right back. 